Yo, what's good YouTube? Back with another video today and they finally released the trailer for my boy Ermac. So I'm not even gonna waste any more time talking. Let's just dive in because I'm really excited for this trailer. <laughs> Thank God they put a mask on my boy. The souls of your ancestors. They're showing a little bit too much forehead too, but you know, I'm sure they'll charge a ten dollar skin for one that actually looks really, really cool. Oh, I just realized he had a new cameo with him too. Looks so sick, bro! I'm so excited for this character. They hit, ooh, they hit. Okay, yeah, they cancel. I love cancel characters. They changed a lot of his animation, so I'm surprised his soul stuff looks so different. I like the change though. It kind of reminds me of Quan Chi. You might be many, but I am the one. My boy Kun Lao always talking his smack and always getting disrespected. Who is that? Yeah, a lot of this stuff looks like it looks really like similar to Quan Chi. And all these new demons he's summoning looks pretty Changed fucking sick. Since we first met. We believe for the better. We got his teleport. I have no idea what the fuck just happened. Ooh, nasty grab. And it's really cool that he floats too. He doesn't walk. That's so fire. And he has combos. Look, this this is my character. Look, I love Kung Lao and Scorpion, but I've, I've been an Ermac main, so I've been needing him. Ah, <laughs> oh, nah, that's just ew. What the fuck? Creativity. His his fatalities are always super similar, but that was that was different. Wins. Well, I'm I honestly. Oh, wait a minute. In the cameo character, Mavado, whatever his name is. Like that goofy ass mentality. But Ermat looks pretty dope. Honestly, like I was kind of worried, especially when they first revealed him, because this man had no mask and he was showing way too much skin. He's still showing a lot of skin, but I think he looks good. I mean, obviously, we're gonna get again like a ten dollar premium skin that's probably gonna be fire. And unfortunately, I'm gonna buy it. But I'm very happy that his uh gear piece is his mask and not something stupid like the little chest piece he has or something like that. And I also I'm kind of in on like on his on the bottom half, it looks like he's wearing skinny jeans low key. Like, I don't know about that. But honestly, like, the design, as scared as I was when they first showed him, like, I'm, I'm kind of messing with it, you know? So, I like a lot of the changes they made to him. It looks, it does look pretty similar to Quan Chi in terms of, like, all the soles and the hands and stuff like that. But I, I think it's like a welcome change. And he looks, he looks really sick. I can't wait. Obviously, like, I haven't been playing a lot of MK at all. And it's, it's partly because of Tekken, but also because, like I said, like I've been waiting for Ermac, and honestly, like I think um after or a little bit before Peacemaker or when Tekken Seven dropped, I kind of knew like I probably wasn't gonna be playing heavily until Ermac came out. But based off what I saw, he looks dope. Uh, but yeah, um, as always, if you made it all the way to the end of the video, thank you so much for watching. Uh, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.